Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to the Carthaginian campaign part number 5. Here we are on the campaign map and if you remember from last time, we took Kartuba with this force, the pride of Mago, and we now have a sort of unified south. We have Kartuba and Kartadach and we also have our allies in Gadira, Nova Carthago. And now we're looking at perhaps taking Syracuse as well because we have a war going on over here against Syracuse and I've just moved Hannibal the heirs of Phoenicia forward and I'm hoping to take out Syracuse pretty soon um, I need my ships to come around as well. Uh, well I'll probably leave my ships there to defend because I've also got my general Merbal there I'm going to end the turn Quite low on food, I just noticed that. I'm going to have to do something about that. But I hope you're all doing fine. Hope you're enjoying Total War Room 2 and enjoying my coverage of the game since its release. I've got a couple of online battles on my channel and I'm looking to do some more online battles in the future. If you're interested in playing me on multiplayer, let me know. Add me on Steam. All my links will be in the description. And perhaps one day, one of your... Uh, battles against me will be featured on my channel so let me know and we can see how we can arrange um, I have updated the game the first patch from the creative assembly which has allowed me to alter some of my settings so my unit detail is now up to high it was on medium I did have to go on low and medium settings initially because I couldn't barely play the game but now um, I'm playing on mainly medium settings, but I have got one or two on high, so it's got a bit better. And I'm getting an average of about 23 to 25 frames per second on the campaign map at the moment. So, um, hopefully the game won't crash. I was going to do a Swaby campaign. I did actually start the video and start recording. And I was about a minute into the video when it crashed. And it ca crashed right on the campaign map when I was, when I was going to start up a confederation with one of the local tribes, so yeah, that's a bit irritating, a bit disappointing, but oh well. Luckily Carthage hasn't crashed on me yet, and hopefully it won't crash. But we're, here we are back now, um, do we have Garrison Army has lost attrition? Ah, oh, of course. Population surplus in Sardinia. Encourage population, quartermasters report, and, and happy populace. Right, we're trying to sort out the population then. These guys are not that happy. We can convert to Mandalore. We want to expand, don't we? To so we'll expand the city. And what can we build? We can build consecrated ground. I will leave that for now. Kralis isn't part of attrition. How have I got attrition in my own province? We fight for you, my oh, lord. is it because they fight to me? I'm confused. I was, how am I getting attrition? 85. The public order is fine. How am I getting... How am I getting attrition in my own province? This doesn't make sense. Let's got a couple more units there. Uh, I could... I'm going to have to leave my ships there. I'm afraid. But Hannibal can march on, I My think. Lord. Uh, yeah. Hannibal will attack. Oh my god, they have reinforcements. <laughs> shit. <laughs> shit, shit, shit. What have they got? They've got Schlingers, Militia Hoplites. A couple of boats as well. And they have Militia Hoplites and Mob. They're not really that strong, are they? I mean, we got Libyan Hoplites and a general, of course. We'll fight this battle on the campaign map. Even though we're at a big disadvantage numerically, I do think that we can actually defeat this army if we are quick. If we can jump in quickly, I think we can defeat them. Then again, I've attacked them, so I've got to go for them. But hopefully we can actually destroy Syracuse and take this settlement. Because that should improve things with me.
be a pretty slow campaign so far. We're only 12 turns in. That's 12 years into the future. And this is actually Hannibal's first battle, I believe. So hopefully we can do the Proud General well. Ooh, this is fog. We don't fog. Well, I'll do. Dry. And there's the city right there. We can deploy, right? Can we deploy right there? We can. Right. All my javelin men. I'm going to group them together in two groups. So we'll have javelin group one. And they can attack here. And they can have four units of hoplites behind them. Oops, lazy. Let me do that. Like so. We'll do the same now here. Four hoplites. Uh, four uh, javelin men. And we're going to attack from this side of the city. And we'll have four more units behind, like so. And what we have left then is my general and these three units, which I'm going to keep all together. So my general is going to go here, put the skirmishers in front of him in a long line with infantry nearby in case. We'll start the battle there, and where are they? Can't actually see anybody. Enemy reinforcements ah, right, approaching. If and turn that off. In that case, we're gonna need to be quick about this to capture the settlement. So let's march them in. Oh, there they are, are they? Didn't even see them. Right line of sight, being a bugger. Let's bring out the javelin men for this pass here. What are your order? Our spears are yours. Bring my spearmen forward. About there. I'm still going to rush these men into the city because I think I can get around them from that position. I bring these across. To there. Try to flank around them. Here we are men running into the city behind them. It could actually flank around now. They have ships reinforcing them in the distance over there. So I'm going to have to be wary of that. And look, we've actually forced them backwards now. Let's bring all my men forward. Get my slingers involved. I have to take these guys out now. Rapid advance. Rapid advance. Let's get all my stingers in there. There we go, so far so good. I have to be wary of those ships. Probably not safe to have Hannibal there, so we'll bring him inside here. My javelin men have made short work of their men there. Let's get them up as well into the city quickly. Doing pretty well so far. It's the reinforcements I have to worry about. Let's get these javelin men in straight away. Get these onto the mob units now. How are we doing? Doing pretty well. Don't route. Oh, the men have started the route now. That's not good. Don't route. Please don't route on me. Turn the phalanx formation. May help us out. My spearmen are running in now. Rapid advance. Put phalanx on. Right, they've done their job, by the looks of it. Get some of these hoplites. Get two of these hoplites, as a matter of fact. You turn around. 
get these men to the capture point quickly. If we can get to the capture point, which I should be doing with Hannibal, really. If we can get our men to the capture point as quickly as possible. Then we should be doing okay. My slingers have been caught up. Not the slingers, they are my... My hoplites. Throw some of these men in this big cluster here. I'm gonna get these men, these slingers to, well, ja these javelin men, I should say, to help reinforce. If I can take this city quickly, we've got a good chance. But my men have got to get in here as quickly as possible. They're gonna be attacking from over here. Let's get that javelin unit up. Hoplite unit. So they, we are starting to take the city now. These men have all come back to me. Thank God for that. These men are going to run across. Up there. Make sure you're doing well. Turn to phalanx. Get stuck in. Let's get these hoplites over there. We're holding this uh, command post at the moment, but these ships are getting nearer and nearer to us. And they do actually have some units heading towards us now. So we get our javelin men up there and my hoplites. Keep the general there. Can't lose this capture point now. They just walk right through my men somehow. Oh, look at this. They're going to steal it from me. Four, three, two, one. Have you won the battle? I'm not sure. They just ignored me. They ignored my men. Oh, we won it. We've done it. Finally. Cost, uh, coast victory. Did you just see that then? No, they, they completely ignored my men and just ran for this capture point. That's terrible. Terrible display by the AI. Not caring about fighting my men and using tactics, just running right through. They outnumbered me two to one easily. Look at that. They had 2,520 men. I had just short of 2,000. We killed over 1,000 of them. They killed over 500 of us, so... That should cripple them. If they do attack me again now, I've got a much better numbers game. But I think they're gone. They should be gone from the map now. This is their only province, Syracuse. So Hannibal has done well. He's killed a general. Close victory. Captured 130 of them. We could raise. We could subjugate. We could loot. I'd rather have occupy. Increase in rank for Hannibal. We fight for you, my lord. And somehow they do have another ship. Full of men. I live to Let's get Hannibal. Oh, I don't want him in the port. I actually want him in the city. Oh, mind you saying that, having an extra those extra ships will prove handy. Fleet reporting, I want him lord. in the city though. Uh, my lord. General details. Plus seal authority. Can I? I'll go for commander. For Hannibal. My spy. Oh, I I'd have two you. spies. Lady Tanit, bless our journey. Bring one there, have one go over there. I am eager to serve. And Seracus doesn't like me that much. As you would expect. Oh, hang on, current public order. We're losing minus 16. We'll be, we'll be to 9 after this. And we're 8 turns away from rebellion, apparently. That's not good at all. We're going to have to start spending our money on upgrading some of these buildings, but I think that I may end this episode there. So we've actually achieved something. We've defeated Syracus, but unfortunately they're still alive somehow. And they do have three ships with troops on them around my borders. I'm going to keep this ship nearby. Move into my city, actually. My port. Got my general as well. They'll probably aim for Lily Bay, I imagine, so... I'm going to have to reinforce Lily Bayam. I 
can't afford anything at the moment though. But I'm going to end the episode there, so hope you've enjoyed. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.